All right, we are live, everybody, and welcome to tonight's call, guys. If you're just tuning in and joining us for the first time, please get excited. Just put a comment right below on the page and let us know that you're live. Oh, and by the way, you see, we are live, and sometimes we make mistakes as well. So I know that for a fact you guys can't see this on the page yet, so just give me like two seconds while I fix that um, because right now everybody's probably looking at a timer. So let me turn the timer off. All right, and then you guys should see it right now. So I'm going to refresh the page just to make sure. And yes, the video is there, guys. So yes, again, like I said, we're human. We make mistakes. We welcome everybody to tonight's call. We're going to have an amazing, amazing good time. I got a panelist full of rock stars. You're going to hear from people uh, who've had success in this opportunity that we're going to share with you tonight. And it's people from all walks of this country, okay, from people who've never done online business before to people who have done several business before, like myself, and had an opportunity to make money in other companies. We decided to come together here in this opportunity and share with you some amazing, amazing results people are having. My name is Alfredo, and you're going to hear from also my wife, Christina Delgado, as well, and many others, like I said, that, uh, you know, we're struggling. And it might be you. It might be you might be on this call right now because someone invited you and truthfully it's because they cared enough about you to show you something that could change your life because just like you're watching this video right now i was one of those people as well that came across something online how to make money from home how to quit your job how to you know whatever make an extra a uh, couple hundred bucks a week whatever it was that you googled or you found you found somebody somewhere that shared this video with you because they care enough about your future and they want to show you a way that you can break out of the poverty or the chains and just start having success. A little bit about myself before I get into introducing the rest of the panelists. I don't want to take up too much time because we want to hear from everybody tonight. Um, me, myself, my name is Alfredo. I've come from a corporate world. I used to do taxes for a living. I hated it because during tax season, I was never, ever, ever home. Okay, and that's the part that used to kill me because I didn't care how much money I made. But everybody knows, or anyone who does taxes know that from January to the end of April, you have no life, and you might as well just kiss your family goodbye because you don't get to see them. All right, and that was me. So I, you know, I used to make money uh, overtime. I used to stay late, but it wasn't worth it because at the end of the day, I was still looking at my check and still wondering how we're going to pay the bills next week. How are we going to be able to provide our family because we do have six children at home, guys. So for you who have children and you're struggling, you need to listen up because I was that person, okay? Long story short, job wasn't cutting it. We were, uh, me and my wife were on food stamps. You're gonna hear a story in a, in a few minutes. We were on food stamps. We didn't have enough money. We couldn't cover the bills. We decided to move out of that situation. I decided to quit my job. We came out and moved to Pennsylvania where we came. We decided to raise our family. Again, when we moved out here, we had no job. We had nothing working for us. Like I said, we were collecting food stamps. I used to go down to Center City, collect food stamps, and one day I sat in that office, and what really struck me is that when I looked around, and I'll never, ever forget this. I tell this on stage when I speak. I tell this to people all around the world, that whenever, that one time I was in that office, that food stamp office, and I, I can remember like it was yesterday. I sat down, and I looked over to the left, and I looked over to the right, and I saw the kind of people that were there, and I told myself, I even looked at the security guy. I said, oh, my God, the guy's like nine years old, and this is what he's doing for a living. I said, this is not me. This is not what God made me to be. He made me better than this. He made you better than this. He made you. He made everyone to succeed. The, the, the problem is that people don't realize that. They think that this is all they have. So when I looked around the, the food stamp office where people were waiting to, to uh, renew their, um, I, don't, I forgot what it was there their uh, benefits and stuff. I think it's like every six months. That's what I went there for. You know, they look like they just had no hope. Like they, that's all I could explain. I just looked in people's faces. They were like, they just, that was their life. And I said, this is not it. This can't be it. This is not what I was brought up to be. You know, so from that day forward, I said, look, things got to change. I told my wife, look, the next time our food stamps is running out. Okay, don't renew. And she can tell you that. That was the dead truth. It was a scary moment, especially when you're getting over $1,000 a month to feed your family and you're giving that up. But I did it because I knew that we were worth something better than that. I was willing to sacrifice that. I even told her, I said, we don't need it no more. We can't 
sit here and try to change our lives and make money for our families and still have the mentality of us needing that assistance from the government. It's just not going to work. There's no way that we're going to be able to operate like that. We can't come online and tell people how to change their lives, change their lives. Meanwhile, we're struggling ourselves. So we decided to, to forfeit our food stamps and pay it ourselves. That was like over a thousand dollars right there and then that we gave up because we believed in this online business so much that we were willing to make that sacrifice. It was scary. I didn't have a job and I didn't have any real money coming in. I started venturing online. I started learning about how to make money from home, how to operate online business. Long story short, I don't want to take up too much time, but we are, we've been, me and my wife been online for about six years now. Okay. We have happened. We've been blessed to earn several million dollars online. Okay. More than one with this online business. And it all started by watching a video just like the one you're watching right now, where someone told you that there is a greater opportunity out there, where, where someone was trying to convince you that there is something that you can do to change your life. All you have to do is get started. So on the bottom of this page, there's going to be two buttons, one that says more info and the other one that says get started. If you still need more information about this opportunity, because I know I didn't explain it too much, but that's okay because we have other people that are going to come on. You can click that button anytime because whoever invited you uh, will get the credit for, for showing you this video. Click that button anytime. Learn more about this opportunity, how it could change your life. Or if you're convinced that this is something you want to do for you, for your future, for your family, there's a button below that says get started. Just go ahead and get started, and we will be more than happy to welcome you inside of our community. We have a huge Facebook group where we're teaching people how to make money online, how to quit the nine to five, how to get out of that vicious cycle, how to stay home with your kids. We're teaching people all of that right here in this business, guys. So I'm not going to keep you on much longer. I'll probably hop on again at the end and tell you guys a little bit more, but that's my story. I just want to let you know, guys, that if you're struggling, if, if you're tired of nine to five, if you're working two to three jobs just to feed your family, you want to spend more time with your kids, you want to have a better relationship with your spouse because finances is one of the number one reasons why people break up and divorce is because they're unhappy with their financial situation. So yes, this does have an effect as well as, you know, in, in cooperation with your marriage or your, or your, your better half or whatever situation you're in. If you want uh, to improve your relationship, you want to be able to take more vacations, you want to be able to spend more quality time. Hell, you even want to be able to eat better because when you make more money, you're allowed, you are now able to, uh, you know, purchase better foods, better quality foods. Like myself, I was overweight. I was uh, reaching like 210 pounds at one point. But because I was blessed to make this money online, I'm able to afford better quality food so I can have a better diet. And since I work from home, I have the opportunity to work from my home gym right downstairs in my own home. All right, guys, so you got to look at the bigger picture. It's not just about the money that's coming in. All right, there's three kinds of freedoms that these businesses allow you to have. And I'll let, uh, I'll let my wife come on in a couple of minutes and explain to you more about that. There's three kinds of freedoms that this allows you to have. Okay, a lot of people like to talk about financial freedom. That's cool. But what a lot of opportunities, like a traditional brick and mortar business or something like that, where you're self employed, but really all you're doing is employing yourself which means you're working more hours to make more money. People don't realize that. Being self-employed is cool, but it's also giving yourself more work to do because now you work for yourself, so you have to put in all the hours. You have to do it, everything yourself to make more money. So they talk about financial freedom, but there's two other kinds of freedoms that this business also allows. That's location freedom because when you're working online, you have – the ability to work from anywhere in the world, as long as you have a laptop and an internet connection, you can operate your business, okay? That's why we were able to move here because we don't care where we live. As long as we have internet, which is anywhere in the world, we can operate our online business. So you have financial freedom, time freedom, okay? Uh, oh, that was location freedom, I'm sorry. Location freedom, and the last one is time freedom. Now, another, uh, Another reason why the online business allows you to have that freedom is because, again, when you're working a nine to five, you have to punch in at nine and punch out at five. When you have your own business, you have to operate that business 
yourself. You have to be there to open your business and to close your business. Here in the online industry, you don't have you can set your own hours, okay? Because we don't work on a traditional salary. We work you don't have your own business, you have to operate right. your business yourself. You have to all right, gotcha. So uh, with online business, we don't only work Monday through Fridays. Our business is 24 hours, seven days a week because we reach all parts of countries and all some some cases, um, all parts of the world. All right, guys. So I'm super excited for you to be on this um, live hangout tonight. I'm super excited and I'm honored to be here to explain to you this business. I'm also honored to be here with my panelists and I'm super excited because you guys are going to discover more about this opportunity tonight. And I encourage you to get started. And if you're not sure how to get started, go ahead and go back with the person who invited you here and get more inf information from them on how to get started. But guys, without further ado, I want to introduce not only my best business partner, but also my better half and uh, someone that believed in me and decided to get into this business as well. And in a short amount of time, her herself, she's earned over six figures just from this business alone. Together, we've earned multiple seven figures. She likes what this business is all about. She's going to be super excited to share with you. She earned her own self over $100,000, guys. I don't even know how much. I don't look at her checks. I'll let her enjoy it. <laughs> but guys, without further ado, I want to introduce my wife, Christina Delgado. Christina, are you there? Yes. What's up, everybody? I'm so excited to be on this panel. We have a panel full of rock stars, people that I even look up to, guys. And this is one of my favorite parts about being in my econ, this amazing opportunity, because all the people here are like-minded people. They all want better for themselves. They all want something, you know, more. They know they have something great inside them, you know. So I'm just so excited to hear their testimonies as well. And, you know, my husband is right. Like, all you need right nowadays is like a Wi-Fi and a dream. You know what I mean? Because nowadays online is everything like you could work online make money from home and i'm just loving it especially since i have six children you know what i mean they take up all my time you know my husband and i get to dedicate my time to them you know what i mean and not have to worry about answering to a boss or going to a nine to five like i used to you know what i mean it sucked it really sucked not um, being in control of my time and letting somebody else control that and take away from my family. You know what I mean? Um, the final straw was me when I quit, when I was able to quit because we were becoming su successful online was, you know, one time um, my daughter, I'm sorry, for one of my child's graduations, they were about to graduate and I had asked for the day off. And my my boss told me I couldn't take off. And this was a, you know, she was graduating from middle school. It was like a big thing. So I wanted to be there and I took off regardless. I didn't care if I was gonna get fired. You know what I mean? But that was my last straw. Maybe some of you are in those situation right now. You know what I mean? And I just wanna first off and, you know, say thank you for taking the time out tonight to jump on this call to find out what you know you could do to stop living paycheck to paycheck guys okay i'm so excited to be a part of this because my econ what they teach you can truly change your life like my husband just said i've earned over a hundred thousand dollars within just seven months we've been a part of this opportunity guys between us combined oh my god it's just like in over three hundred thousand you know what i mean like i never thought this could you know take my income to this level it's crazy i think i'm one of i'm, I'm one of six siblings of um, my mom has six children and i think i'm like the only one to really reach six figures and have six children like that's so expensive guys and you know the great thing about it is that my econ teaches me how to become financially educated it's not only about making money guys it's about you know having great credit you know what i mean overall they're going to teach you how to be financially stable you know how to get more money from your current jobs you know without having to work 
two jobs, three jobs here and there. You know, maybe you're in that situation right now and you have to, you know, leave your kids at home or hire a babysitter. You can't even afford it. And you're just living paycheck to paycheck. This is, I'm telling you, you have to give it a try. This just might be the solution for you. Okay. I mean, I, I heard over 67% of Americans don't have a thousand dollars in their savings for emergency funds, guys. This is this is serious. Like if your car breaks down, something like that, most Americans can't afford to fix it. They have to borrow this, borrow that from you know God knows who. You know what I mean? Don't you want to get out of that cycle? And this is what my econ provides. It helps us to to uh, teach people how to break out of that cycle. Look at what happened about the government shutdown, guys. When I was when I was younger, I was told like, oh, get a government job. You know what I mean? That's secure. Get, you know, you're working for the government. Oh, wow. But look what happened. Like they, they weren't getting paid for weeks and that affected their families. Like, you know, with my econ, we created our own economy. And it's true, you know what I mean? When I first got introduced to it, I heard that and it was like it, it was like bells to my ears because it's a real opportunity, guys, where we don't have to depend on the system anymore. We don't. And it sucks that sometimes we try to talk to people about my econ and all they're worried about is, oh, well, I get social security, I get benefits. What is, is are they gonna stop my benefits? Are they gonna stop my checks? Well, you know that you can make 10 times more than what they're giving you? Like, if you're comfortable with just, you know, living under their, you know, circumstance, how much they wanna give you, then go ahead and live like that, you know? But I suggest you take that little amount of, you know, it's $49.95 to get started. Take that money and invest it into yourself so that maybe you could build your own business. You know what I mean? And really take it serious. Start building your credit so you don't have to use your own money and use other people's money like the bank. You know what I mean? So this is what we're teaching you in my econ and so much more, even how to save money, how to invest your money, you know, how to invest in, you know, properties and things like that so that you could pass it down to your children, how to save that, you know, and just multiply it. Like, and like, you know, one of my mentor, Angela uh, Williams, that's on the panel right now, she said, have teach your money how to make babies for you okay have your money make babies for you and that's what we're here to teach you today okay guys i could definitely go on and on about how excited i am and everything that my econ has to offer guys it has truly changed my life i mean truly for me and my family so i'm always excited to be on these panels but i want to hear from everybody else i don't want to take up all the time but thank you thank you guys for uh you know hearing me out and jumping on this call tonight. And you know, if you're ready to join, click that link below. We have training that we're gonna provide you, okay, when you do become a part of this opportunity so you're not gonna be lost. We have an amazing group. You're gonna get to, you know, interact with all the leaders and, you know, panelists on this call tonight, all right? So even, we have an event coming up, guys, and we're all gonna be together. And these events are so powerful. They, they always take our business to the next level. And I'm so excited uh, in March to see everybody as well. So I'm gonna introduce Leticia, one of my awesome some business partners without further ado go ahead Leticia take it over hey thank you so much that was powerful you guys and I want to tap more into that once again if you don't know me I'm Leticia for coming straight out of sunny SoCal it's your favorite girl and since I've joined my econ oh my god you guys I'll, I'm gonna share my testimony after but I really wanted to dive in really quick um, about what Christina was talking about, how, why you're living paycheck to paycheck. Some of us don't know why. And then also why you don't have a savings, okay? Right now, you're probably stressed out. You got bad health. You're making bad decisions. You don't know what to do. Well, this is where you need to ask yourself, okay? 
why don't you have enough, okay? If you are a W-2 employee, employee, there's four things right now that are killing your finances, guys. Four things. It's going to blow your mind. If you're taking notes right now, please write it down. Number one is taxes. Right now, a third of your income is being taken out, okay? A third of your income is being taken away from your checks. So right now, between January and April, that's a third of the year. That means that's a third of the year that you're working for free, okay? We don't want that no more, okay? Look at your gross and look at your net. It might make you sick, okay? So number two is the silent income killer, guys, okay? I remember when a can of soup was 90 cents. Now I go to the grocery store, it's like $4 for a can of soup. So now that, you know, when inflation keeps increasing like that, did your boss increase your pay to match yeah. that? Probably not. Okay, so that is why you're dishing out more every single month as the years in the month go by. You're putting out more money and you're like, where's all my money going? Well, that's not helping either on gas, food, all your daily living activities. Okay, that's another third, guys. Okay, now number three, you're probably like, man, I need something to show for all of my hard work. You probably got one job over here, then you got a night job and you have nothing to show for. So you're like, you know what? I want to get something that I can see every day for my hard work. I'm going to go buy me a car. Okay? And then after that, you're like, wait a minute, I got bills. So that's borrowed money from your car right there. That's more interest being taken from you, right? More money. And then you're going to put your bills on a credit card. That's more mm -hmm. borrowed money, more interest. Okay? That's another third of your income gone, guys. I'm not good at math or anything like that, but already I feel like all my money is gone from those three things. Number four, you probably see it. It happens all the time. It's every single month. It's big business, guys, okay? We just had it. Thanksgiving, Christmas, New Year's, Valentine's is coming up. We got Easter. We got Mother's Day. We got Father's Day. I mean, should I go on? You know, Fourth of July, like, all the way up to Halloween and back again. Every single month, big business. They're taking your little bit of money that you thought you had, okay? And now you're like, Broke. It's a whole cycle. It's a hamster wheel. We need to stop this. You guys, when I told my parents this information, they finally started supporting me online for working from home. They started supporting me because they started crying. They're like, whoa, I didn't even realize that. Tisha, keep going. Keep doing it. Because they felt so bad that they kept telling me, go to school, go to school. But getting my master's degree left me $104,000 in debt. $104,000 in debt. They felt so bad, okay? And I used to, you know, pay creditors to help me with my credit every month because my credit was shot from not being able to pay my $2,000 a month loans off, right? And so I was throwing hundreds away, but they weren't even fixing my credit. My credit went down even worse. So I'm so thankful for my econ because now that, you know, I have the financial education, I got the, I got the vehicle, I got the system, I got the software, I plugged in as soon as I started. I'm only on my fifth month, and within two months, I increased my credit score 111 points, guys. I wrote off $3,800 as well. So I didn't even know that I can do it, but if you think it's hard, it's not. It's so easy. You just got to get started and click that button below, baby. Yeah. That's all you got to do. You got to get started, okay? And we want to, you know, pour into you and give you this information. And that way, once you get your testimony and your results, you're going to want to share it out organically. You're just going to get an extra piece of income every single Friday. So thank you so much for having me on. I want to introduce my girl, though. Uh, we're going to talk about her testimony as well. Kylie, are you there? Kylie. Um, yes. Unfortunately, somehow my camera isn't working. But um, oh, my name is Kylie Stubbs, and um, I'm a mother of six, and I got into this because I was tired of wondering why my new job that I got, getting paid $19 an hour, was still not making a cut. And so I looked online, and I got into um, – basically um, going on to make money at home because I really didn't want to be any more away from my kids because I was going about 16 hours a day. So I looked at it and sure enough, I wasn't doing the smart decision. I was thinking on my W-4 that I should put singled at a, married at a single rate 
which was taking about three, um, about like three hundred and fifty six dollars every um, every week out of my check due to overtime and all that excess taxes. So once I actually was able to adjust it, I was able to basically instead of um, paying twenty eight percent in taxes, it got down to about eight point five percent. So it was saving me a lot of money because even though I worked that hours, I wasn't getting that money. So um, like on one check, I had, I think my gross pay was um, $1,269 and I only got paid $912 of that. So when you do the math and actually do the taxes, it wasn't really going there. And the fact that now I'm getting more money in my check I'm able to use that instead of having to go oh well I can't pay for this I need to go get a loan so now I'm able to not having to go get loan and be more in debt I'm able to take that money and put it to where it needs to be so um, and it, it works and I was I was really glad that it did work because um, most of the time I've seen other people saying that it did but this this actually worked and Right now, I'm at the middle of doing uh, my credit to make that go up, and once that does, I'm gonna put my testimony there. So, I'm going to introduce, I believe, Cedric, um, and have him tell you basically more about what's going on. So. Hey, 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 can you hear me, can you hear me? Yes, sir, we hear you. <laughs> How y'all doing out there, world? Uh, I'm actually looked down instead of straight ahead. But uh, listen, you guys, I've been a part of my econ since 2016, January of 2016. And I'm going to tell y'all right now, before my econ, I was a hustler. Like, not, not talking about selling any drugs or anything like that. What I mean by that is, you know, um, I was selling different products, different services, lotions, potions, vacation packages, you name it, I did it all. I even sold Kirby vacuum cleaners. I was a hustler, that's what was in my blood. Like if I needed money, I'm gonna go get money. I knew how to make money, you guys. That's what I mean by being a hustler. You know, for example, if, if you buy a car from the auction for $2,000 and you, you fix it up, right, and you resell it for $5,000, you just made a $3,000 profit, but guess what? You have to keep on doing that thing over and over and over again, right? Just like real estate, you go buy a house for wholesale, you, you put some work in it, you flip the house, you get paid a lump sum of money, but you have to keep on doing that over and over and over, right? That's hustling, you guys. And I was at the point where I was tired of hustling, you guys. So when I joined my econ, you guys, and they shared a strategy called income shifting with me, Basically, that's being able to generate more money without extra labor. And the first strategy I learned was a simple sheet of paper, a W-4 form. With this W-4 form, we was helping people receive an extra two to $500 every single month on their job without selling anything, without signing anybody up. Once I understood that, that was powerful because I've been in opportunities in companies where you got to recruit and sign up this many people or or uh, sell this many products or services just to make $500 a month. So once I understood that, you guys, it was a wrap. Not only that, I learned three key things over here in my econ. My econ taught me how to make more money, right? My econ taught me how to manage my money better, and my econ also taught, taught me how to multiply my money. With all the uh, debt elimination strategies, all the investing strategies, um, all the minimizing taxes, uh, the do-it-yourself credit repair, you guys, I felt like, you know, uh, I couldn't be touched with the financial knowledge, financial literacy, everything that I had learned, like they created a whole nother monster. That's why, you know, it's been about uh, three years now since I've been in the company and I've went out and built a million dollar empire. Matter of fact, a multi-million dollar empire from offline and it has allowed me to uh, open up other businesses. I also have a tax company. Um, I have a t-shirt business. I have a promotional company. So it allowed me to open up more streams of income. But what I had to do was uh, stay focused, stay consistent, 
keep my eyes on the prize. You know, when, when things got rough, I didn't jump ship. When things got tough, you know, I didn't, I didn't run. I didn't jump to the next thing. I stayed focused. I stayed consistent. I put my foot on the gas and it was all gas, no brakes, you guys. So what I want to tell you guys out there is, you know, when my grind, right, when my grind, my hard work became bigger than my dreams, my dreams happened by default. When my grind became bigger than my dreams, my dreams happened by default. And what I mean by that is it's easy to dream about the big cars. It's easy to dream about the big houses. It's easy to dream about the finer things in life, right? But if your grind, your hard work doesn't match up with these big dreams, it'll never happen. So listen, it's time to stop dreaming, y'all. And it's time to put in that work, put in that grind, try something different, y'all. It's time to try something different. It's 2019. You know, I want you to think about one thing. I'm going to leave y'all with this, right? I want you to think about all the money you made in the last five years, right? All of it. I don't care if it was a refund check, a work check, a social security check. Uh, think about all the money you'd have made in the last five years. It's probably a big number, right? That number is probably huge, right? Now, ask yourself how much of that money is in your bank account right now. You ain't got to tell me. Ask yourself how much of that money is in your bank account right now. So what I'm asking you is if you continue to do the same thing you've been doing for the last five years over the next five years, where do you think you're going to find yourself at in the next five years in the same situation? So in order to get different results, you got to try something different. And this is there something different for you because it's not, it's, it blessed me and it blessed hundreds and thousands of other people. So um, the next person I'm going to introduce you guys to is um, this lady. She actually played a big part of, of taking me to the next level because you never know when, you know, God has sent you that, that ace of spades. Or that joker is gonna take you to the next level. You know, a lot, of, a lot of people think uh, this is my big sister because we have the same name and we got the same drive and the same hustle. So, without further ado, I want to introduce y'all to Miss EVP CEO Infinity, Angela Williams. Angela, I got y'all online. Yes, can you hear me? Loud and clear. Take it away. All right, you guys, I'm so excited to be here tonight. Um, again, I'm a CEO Infinity uh, with my econ. I've been in the business for uh, a little over uh, two years. Um, before that, I was in corporate America climbing the ladder, and then I got laid off. And then after I got laid off um, and lost everything that I own, I decided that I was no longer going to work for somebody else because I knew that if I only had one source of income, I was going to be forever written my lifestyle. And so I am excited to say that I have not worked a job in 11 years. I am a business owner. I have my own tax business. I'm also a day trader. Yes, we hustle over here. And what I want you to know, the reason why my econ is one of the most amazing companies that you can ever get your, your hands on is we teach you everything you need to know about money. Real simple. You know, we're going to show you how you can increase your cash flow without getting another job, without going back to school, getting more student loans in the hopes to get a better job. Now, you have heard our panelists talk about the power of income shifting. And what I want you to understand, especially when it comes to adjusting your W-4, it's really a trap. Because if you were to actually read the W-4 line for line and you actually fill it out correctly, you will find yourself owing at the end of the year. And that is why our mother and our father told us, you know, just write zero or just write one because you're going to end up owing. The reason why you owe is because you don't have enough tax write-offs at the end of the year to offset your tax liability. And so because my econ is a financial literacy education company, we're going to show you how just by having a home-based business, by partnering with my econ, we're going to give you a sole proprietor tax status. So what that means is that now you're going to have business write-offs that's going to offset your tax liability and you can keep more of your hard-earned money. So let me put this in perspective for you. A monthly membership in my econ is about $34.95 a month. 
Now, I want you to think about this. Let's say you adjust your W-4, and after adjusting your W-4, you get an extra $300 back into your paycheck, and you get paid twice a month, so let's say that's $600 a month. That means that every month that you pay your membership, you continue to unlock that $600 a month in your paycheck. So what's going to happen is the lifestyle expenses. Everybody may be paying a car note. You may be putting gas in your car. You may have a cell phone bill. You may be eat out at restaurants. You might drink coffee every morning. You may be travel. You may be have small children where we can teach you how to hire your children into your My Econ business and you can write off up to 12,000 per child. So think about those monthly expenses, things you already paying for. Well, when you have a business attached to your income, those lifestyle expenses can be converted into business expenses. So every month that you're paying your membership, you're getting that extra money in your paycheck and you're qualifying for those lifestyle expenses. Now, fast forward a year. What is that going to look like? You get the extra $600 cash every single month. At the end of the year, you have got $7,200. That's $7,200 cash that you now get to keep in your bank account and you didn't have to work another job to get it. And let's say you qualify for twelve hundred dollars, uh, maybe a little bit over a thousand dollars in business expenses that you qualify for every month. You can have over twelve thousand, fourteen thousand in business write offs plus seventy two hundred dollars. And the only thing you paid was what? Thirty four dollars and ninety five cents a month. What other business opportunity do you know of right now that teaches you about business write offs? that teaches you how to keep more of your money. I can't think of one. And not only do we teach you how to increase your cash flow and minimize your taxes, but we also are gonna show you how if you got that extra $7,200, you can take some of that money and you can stack up your bank account, but you can also take the rest of that money and you can start eliminating debt. And you can pay off your debt five times faster than if you was just budgeting alone. And then we're gonna show you how to restore and, and, and rebuild your credit report so that you can get in the 700 club so that when you're borrowing other people's money, you're getting it dirt cheap because you qualify for low interest rates. But it doesn't stop there. See, in my econ, we're also gonna teach you the language of investing. So you need to know the difference between CDs and mutual funds. You need to know the difference between index funds. You need to know when to be in the bond market, when not to be in the bond market. We are also very big on you owning a piece of America. So we want you to um, actually own stocks and companies that you spend your money at. So we're teaching you how to pay attention to your 401k balance, giving you extra cash so that you can build for your long-term investment. And then there's many of us that are in my econ who are also traders. You know, you may be trading, you know, Bitcoin, you may be trading Forex, me, myself, I'm a day trader, I'm a swing trader, I'm a scalper of stocks, Forex and commodities. So I actually make money when the markets go up or when the markets go down. So what I want to impress upon you, if your friends that you're hanging around with is not talking about money, if the friends that you're hanging around with is not talking about paying off their mortgages faster, if your friends are not talking about having a higher credit score, if your friends is not talking about uh, their retirement accounts, if your friends is not even talking about building a financial legacy for their children, then you need to change your circle. And we have one of the best circles in the world. See, it's not about the difference between the rich and the poor. It's not about the difference between the haves and the have-nots. See, really, the difference is between those who know and those who don't know. See, people who don't know, they continue to struggle for money. They go paycheck to paycheck. Money runs away from them because they don't know the power of their money. They don't respect their money. They don't know how to grow their money, and they don't know how to multiply their money. See, people like us, we're in the know. We wake up to money. Money is attracted to us. We can make money out of thin air. And that's what we want to do. We want to teach you to how to have a stronger financial house. And we want to make sure that we put you on the right way 
of money. So whoever invited you to this webinar, you need to be on their phones. You need to be telling them, I don't know what I need to do, but whatever I need to do, I am ready for it because this is the best investment that you will ever make for your life. And I'm telling you, these are strategies that you could pass on to your children. And so the legacy that you leave is going to be there for your children's 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 children. So the next person that I would like to bring up is a high rolling heavy hitter, high six figure income earner uh, who has learned to actually make money from the comfort of his home and provide for his family. I want to bring up no other than uh, CEO Infinity Deal. Oh, e EVP Infinity. We'll, we'll make sure we get it. <laughs> I, I, ha I haven't earned that honor yet, but I'm working on it. Thanks, <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Angela. Look, so look, I don't know what you're waiting for. I'd say at this point, there's a button below me. Click on that button and sign up now. I'm going to talk a little bit about me, but right now, if you're ready to get started after hearing what Angela said, Cedric, Leticia, uh, Christina, Kaylee, uh, I mean, Alfredo kicked this off. Right now, there shouldn't be any doubt. If you're tired of being tired, if you feel like you're spinning yourself in that hamster wheel, you're doing the same thing over and over. Cedric hit on the nail. It's just five years ago, you made X, but you don't have that in your bank account today. Well, five years from today, if you take no action on what you're seeing today, you're going to be in the same exact situation you're in right now. I'm guarantee you. Leticia told you why. She gave you the four reasons why you're still in the same spot. So look, uh, before I, I go off a little bit about my story, uh, you've heard some amazing testimony already. Uh, mine is very similar and somewhat different than many of them. You know, first and foremost, my name is Dios Neddy Pellegrin. Everyone calls me Dios. Just much easier to remember. Um, I've been in this industry as a whole, this online industry, just over two years. So I'm a newbie. I'm still brand new. I, I'm learning. I'm just like everybody else learning, but I'm a fast learner and I'm a sponge and I learn from anybody. I don't care what level you're on. I'm going to get something from everybody and use it to improve my business. Um, I've been in my econ just about, I think we're hitting eight months. We're either at eight months, under eight months, or just over eight months, but we're right around eight months. This business has changed my life. I mean, it's hands down changed my life, and I'll explain to you why. Um, in these eight months with my econ, give or take, um, I've generated just under $110,000 with just the compensation plan. I'm not gonna talk about the hundreds and thousands of dollars I've generated from improving my credit because my credit took a shot, and I'll explain why. I'm not talking about the uh, investments that I'm taking and the strategies I've learned thanks to this business. The tax education, the thousands and thousands of dollars I'm learning because now I'm using the cash flow manager, the software that's available when you sign up with that button and I'm tracking all my receipts because everything I spend my money on, I find every which way possible to turn it into a write-off because that goes back to what the other people were saying that if you're an employee right now, there's nothing wrong with that, but you got to take action right now, click that button and get started because you're paying too much. I mean, you're literally working from right now, January through April for free. Then you really start paying yourself after April and through the rest of the year. By that time, inflation, uh, the expense of living, all that other stuff is taking the rest of the money. That's why you're still spending yourself in that hamster wheel. So, so you know, $110,000, that's amazing. But let me tell you my backstory. Uh, June of 2017, I was laid off. I spent 14, 15 years, so similar to... Angela, I spent 14, 15 years in corporate America and I was laid off. The great news is, and this is funny, uh, Alfredo knows this because we've been together for a while, Christine as well. That was actually one of the happiest days for me when I received my severance and I got laid off. Why? Because I saw a video similar to the one you're watching right now. I saw a video six months prior to getting laid off about this industry. This industry has changed my life, obviously, specifically my econ in all reality. But I, I started in this industry six months before I got laid off. So when I got laid off, it was excited. I can no longer have to give 45, 50 hours to the man. And look, I left a six-figure job and I didn't want to go back to any six-figure job. So I'm not here sitting telling you, you know, I was struggling. I'm not going to say I was great because that I'd be lying to you. Even in making six figures, I wasn't great. I can still do things. I can still, I can still go out. Here's the reason why I never wanted to go back to a job is on average, I would take two weeks of vacation a year. That was on the best case scenario. I would take two, two weeks of vacation. The reason for it is time. 
I didn't have any time freedom. I manage hundreds of people. I manage locations. I've been managing people for the last seven, eight years while I was still employed. And it just, I, I, I'm passionate about my job and I just couldn't get the time off because there was always something going on in my district at my job. And I just never had the time. So when I saw this opportunity and I saw a video just like this one, saw that it's real. And I did my research and I found out that yes, it is real. You do get a 1099. You do pay your taxes. The stuff is legitimate and it does work. Guess what? At that moment when I saw it works and it's real, I said no. And here's the reason why. I just told you what I made in the last eight months with my econ, $110,000. I told you before that when I did my introduction that it took me 14, 15 years in corporate America to go from, I believe the first job I ever held when I finally hit the workforce was about $8.60. My first real job. I had my I had family members who owned a supermarket and I got paid under the table, but my first real job paid me $8.60 an hour. After 14 years, I was finally making Eighty-five to hundred thousand dollars a year. I just finished telling you how this business turned me into a six-figure earner in less than two years because I began this business May of last year, which was still less than two years from when I jumped straight forward. Said nothing else is gonna, nothing else is for me, no matter what my parents and my mom and dad were going crazy. I mean, they were telling me like, like we've heard from stories. They're like, "Papi, I'm Hispanic. Like, Papi, you got to go back to work. You got to get, you got to go back to your job." And I'm like, mom, you know me very well. There's nothing that I touch or I do that I don't give my whole heart and passion to it where I won't become successful. Because the reality of it is anything you've done yourself or that I've done myself, if we never quit, we always see it through and it's going to happen because you all know right now we're talking. Here's a, I'll say it perfectly. Many of you are broke right now. You have no money in your savings. You're living paycheck to paycheck. But when Apple launches that new iPhone in September, October, you find every which way possible to come up with $1,100 to buy that new phone, right? Well, same thing here. I knew that if I get, if I wouldn't quit, if I kept going, eventually the right opportunity will come. That's what this was. Now, let me hit you on a little bit of a bad story. Before I started this business, my econ, I was driving Uber and Lyft. Why? because I was falling into what Cedric said, the lotions, the potions, the magic pills. There's lots of businesses out there online. But when I started, it was struggling. I was still learning. I'm still new. I'm still networking. I'm building my brand. I'm building my name. I'm, I'm falling for this lotion. I'm falling for this potion. I'm falling for this compensation plan. Eventually, my econ hit my inbox and I got into it. $110,000 later, multi-million dollar business by what the co-founder says because right now if i decide which is stupid because that's not who i am to no longer do anything with my econ in this business thanks to the leverage and the compensation plan this business will continue to pay me five figures every single month because of the work that i've done my team has done and the compensation plan that my econ sets forth so that's why I say that this business has changed my life because I don't have to think about corporate anymore. I don't have to think about going to job. I don't have to worry about driving for Uber and Lyft anymore. Now I sit in the back and I'm being driven on a drive on an Uber and a Lyft. So uh, look, these last two years that I've been in this industry have been amazing, amazing from exotic cars I've rented, exotic cars from business partners I've driven, exotic locations I've traveled to. Time freedom is realistically all. I'll end it with this. I have a child with special needs. He was born with spina bifida. He walks. I am blessed as you cannot believe. I would not change it for anything. I, I lucked out and he's doing fantastic. While I was in the corporate world, I missed surgeries. I missed doctor's appointment. I missed memorable and important things that most parents can't go to. I had a job. I couldn't go to it. My wife had to do all that on her own. She's very sentimental. She would go and do those things on her own by herself because I couldn't take the time off. If I would take the time off, my boss would get mad because now I'm asking for way too many time off. We all know you can't get too much time off in your work. I'm here because I needed the time freedom. Now I don't miss a single surgery, a single doctor's appointment. I don't miss a play. I don't miss a role. I don't miss any type of exercises, extra extracurricular activities for either one of my sons. And that's why I'm here because the reality of it is the time freedom is much, much better than dollars. The exotic cars, the locations, all of that stuff is amazing. The money, I just look at it as it, it buys me that freedom where I can stay here in my house, I'm in my basement in my office, and I can make my money 
while I'm here at home and also leverage all this as a tax write-off at the same time. So look, if you're still debating, what I'll tell you is click the button below, sign up now, get started with whoever sent you here. You're going to be in the right place. I guarantee you that. If you want to come in here and use the products, understand the compensation plan, share this with the world. That's literally all we do is we share this everywhere we go. That's it. That's all our job is, is to share this tremendous opportunity with everyone we know and with social media out there and people are going to ask for information. You can give it to them. So uh, with that, thank you all for watching. I want to say God bless you all. I see Alfredo coming back on, so he'll probably end this and take us home. Thank you all for watching. You guys hear me? Yeah, we hear you. Awesome, man. That was powerful, man. I love all the stories I heard tonight. I love everything. You guys are amazing. And this, and listen, here's the problem. We have so many stories and so many amazing testimonies from people just like yourself, just like the ones that we heard on this panel tonight, but we can't fit them all, okay? So you can either keep coming every week and keep hearing from different people, different walks of the country and letting you know more about this opportunity, or you can just hit that button below, get started today, and hopefully we'll see you on the panel one week. So uh, sharing your testimony. So that's it, guys. Thank you all. God bless. Hit, get, hit that button. Get started tonight. And I'll see you guys on the next panel. Take care and God bless. Love you all.